Number 146 in your class work for uh, quadratic equations uh, asks you for the relationship between the discriminant of a quadratic and its graph. So <clears throat> when uh, we have a graph and uh, we have this um, quadratic formula that's given by negative b over 2a plus or minus the discriminant over 2a right if x if this term right remember from the previous sections uh it gives the x uh, coordinate of our vertex uh coordinate of vertex then this uh, plus or minus discriminant over 2a is our uh, x, uh, x uh, shift for the two x intercepts. So let's say if we had uh, our <coughs> axis of symmetry here and a vertex uh, located here, then uh, this vertex is at negative b over 2a. And then this x-intercept, this uh, would be at negative b over 2a plus this discriminant over 2a. And this uh, root would be at negative b over 2a minus this discriminant over 2a. And so... The relationship with the discriminant and and the graph <coughs> uh, yields how many uh, real uh, roots the graph contains. Because if this discriminant is uh, equal to zero then we only have this negative b over 2a term here. So that means we only have one root. If uh, d over 2a is a positive number, then we know that we have these plus and minus solutions. So we would have one and two uh, real roots. That could be the solutions, the quadratic. And of course, um, it could never be negative uh, because uh, the discriminant, right, the, the uh, square root underneath the square root, it can never be uh, a negative value. So the discriminant always has to be uh, greater than or equal to zero. <coughs> so the relationship uh, between just uh, is simply uh, a nice way to uh, see how many real roots we have.